This is volume one in our series on the VDEM Institute's annual Democracy Report 2020. Varieties of Democracy, or VDEM, is the largest democracy measurement project in the world ever. Autocratization can be democracies becoming less democratic, democracies breaking down, or autocracies becoming even more authoritarian. It has characterized the world for over 10 years now, but it's accelerating and doing so fast. This accelerating trend of decline is now affecting major G20 nations, many who are countries with large populations and vast international influence. In the last 10 years, the number of democracies has declined and less than half of all countries are now democracies. Electoral authoritarian countries are countries like Russia, Turkey, Egypt, and Singapore that hold multi-party elections but where media, civil society, or other aspects are not free enough for it to be a democracy. Electoral autocracy is now the most common form of government in the world found in 67 countries, up from 60 just in the last year. The trend is accelerating. That's 92 countries in the world that are not democratic. If we look at averages across the world, they do not show much change. The world average shown in black is declining only a little in the last 10 years, but democracy is ruled by the people. And therefore, we think that it matters how many people are affected. Therefore, in this graph, we weigh those averages by population size. Then the downward trends are much more pronounced. And as you can see, affecting all regions of the world, the trend is accelerating. In fact, in the last 10 years, the share of the world's population who is affected by autocratization has increased from a mere 6% to 34. That's 2.6 billion people. That is the first point. Autocratization surges, the trend is accelerating. The second major finding in the Democracy Report 2020 is equally disturbing. Major countries in the world from the G20 and beyond are affected. Look at this world map. In green, it shows the countries becoming better on democracy in the last 10 years. Look at the orange countries. And deeper color here indicates a more radical sliding back. Countries like Brazil, United States, India, with 1.3 billion people, Hungary and Turkey. Large countries, huge populations, vast international influence. It matters when these countries autocratize. Here are the top 10 worst performers over the last 10 years. Five of them were democracies in 2009, but broke down and are now classified as electoral autocracies. Hungary is now classified as an electoral authoritarian regime. These are the two first and main findings from the Democracy Report 2020 from the VDEM Institute. Read the full details and see all the analysis in the 2020 Democracy Report, Autocratization Surges, Resistance Grows. Visit vdem.net to download your copy of the report. Here you also find the latest version 10 of the dataset online tools for analysis, policy briefs, and much more.